Good morning children. Today it's English time and we are going to learn our first topic that's unit 1 and it's a poem entitled Bridge composed and written by Christina Rossetti. Let's begin by first learning to read the words of the poem correctly. So children you're going to repeat these words after me. Look and say, river, sky, sea, clouds, bridges, heaven, across, earth, prettier, ships, bow. This word can also be pronounced as bow. But in this poem, it is bow, over tops. Now, these were the words which are going to be seen or noticed in the poem. Now, let us read aloud the words and their meanings. The first one, sail. Sail means travel on water. Like you can see, this boat is traveling on water. It means it is sailing on water. Bow. In this poem, bow means a rainbow. Over tops the trees. It means rises above the trees. As you can see in the picture, the rainbow rises above the trees. It means the rainbow over tops the trees. Bridge is a path or a road across a river or a road. So through a bridge you can move from one side to the other side. Many of us use the bridges especially at railway stations, a few on the road as well. Now let us learn to recite the poem. You will recite it after me. Bridge by Christina Rossetti. Boats sail on the rivers and ships sail on the seas. But clouds that sail across the sky are prettier than these. There are bridges on the rivers as pretty as you please. But the bow that bridges heaven and overtops the trees and builds a road from earth to sky is prettier far than these. Now children, let us recite this poem together. Bridge by Christina Rossetti. Both sail on the rivers and ships sail on the seas. But clouds that sail across the sky are prettier than these. There are bridges on the rivers as pretty as you please. But the bow that bridges heaven and overtops the trees and builds a road from earth to sky is prettier far than these. Now let us listen to the explanation of this poem. Let us understand this poem. Let's take the title first. The title is Bridge. Christina Rossetti is the poetess, that is the one who has composed and written this poem. The poem Bridge is about a rainbow composed and written by Christina Rossetti because she is a female, we say, poetess. Let's begin. The poetess Christina Rossetti tells us that boats sail on the rivers. As you can see in this picture, she says boats sail on the rivers and she also says 
ships sail on the seas boats are small ships are big so boats sail on the rivers and ships on the seas but the clouds that move across the sky can you see the clouds moving across the sky so what she says about the clouds is she says that the clouds that moves across the sky are prettier than the boats that sail on the rivers and the ships that sail on the seas so she says the clouds that are moving in the sky are much more prettier than the boats and the ships she also says that there are pretty bridges on the river too so she says not only are the ships and boats pretty and the clouds pretty she says the bridges too are pretty the bridges are built across the river and she says the rainbow that rises above the trees and forms a bridge to heaven so you can see this is the rainbow that is rising above the trees and it's like a bridge just like you see in the bridge across the river here this is a bridge which is going from earth to heaven so she tells us that this bridge is built by building a road from earth to sky so this rainbow is built by bridging earth to sky that is from land earth it goes up to the sky and what she says about this bridge that is the rainbow she says it is far prettier than the river bridges she says that this bridge that is a rainbow is much much more prettier than the bridge that is across the river i hope you have understood the poem now let us name the colors of the rainbow or let us name the colors that are in the rainbow we begin from the lower part that is from the smaller arc or the smaller semicircle so the first color is violet next is indigo blue green yellow orange red so these are the seven colors of the rainbow from down to up it's violet indigo blue green yellow orange and red now let us write down the things that have the following colors let's have the seven colors of the rainbow coming up here can you see them well the seven colors are here let's name them we begin with violet indigo blue green yellow orange and red now we are going to name that is i am going to name one object one article that is of the rainbow colors of the seven colors of the rainbow one at a time we begin with the first one that's violet so what do i have i have a brinjal can you see the brinjal and violet same so violet in color is brinjal next one is indigo we have blueberries you can see them here it's a fruit the blue is sky next green parrots so we have green parrots yellow sunflower orange 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 is a fruit which we all love eating red apple so i have all the seven colors here and for each color i have written one object or one thing of that color and you also can see the pictures here now what you are going to do this is your exercise which you will be completing in your bal bharati book page 2 i have written one you are going to write the next one so you are going to write something 
that is violet in color in this box indigo in color blue green yellow orange and red so this activity children you're going to complete in your balbarti book page 2 thank you